what is happening? Welcome back to Run Through TV. My name is Ben Shepherd, and today one of the most talked about runners in the running world over the past few weeks. Let's hear from him. My name is Jake Smith. I'm a 22 year old, um, well, long distance runner, I guess you can say now, um, living in Cardiff and I'm studying at Cardiff Metropolitan University. Yeah, Jake turns from pacer to racer. Got no, no idea how long I've waited to say that. Yeah, so I was only supposed to pace till 25K and help some of the half marathon marathon boys out. But um, yeah, it was, I was just like, I've done this pacing before, uh, um, a couple of events before, and I do love it. Like I get a lot out of it, a lot of benefit out of it. And I love like helping people out run some fast times. So you heard it now, supposed to drop out at 25K, didn't, but when did Jake actually make the decision? Look, I'm gonna have a crack here at my marathon debut. It was, it was literally, because the guy I was pacing with called, he's called Phil Sessman. We like agreed at like 14 miles. We're like, okay, we'll just do, because each lap was over three and a half miles. We're like, okay, we're going to finish off the next lap. And I was like, I looked at down my watch after about where well, I was supposed to drop out. And I was like, okay, I'm feeling good. I can carry on to the, to the end of this lap. And because my coach was there, but my mum was there and she literally acted like my coach. She was shouting at me saying, Jake, you have to stop. You have to stop. Um, I was like, okay, just one more lap. And then she was like, okay, one more, that's it. And then did another lap. And I was like, I looked at my watch. I was like, I'm nearly at 20 miles. I might as well just, I've, I've ruined my legs as much as I could. I might as well just finish. And yeah, I think on the whole course, my mom was absolutely going mental about it, but it was worth it. <laughs> and if you're wondering, Ben, what time did he do? Please tell us. 2.11, 2.11 flat on debut whilst pacing. That's, I mean, extraordinary. And one of the quickest times of the year as well, actually Olympic qualifying time. So whew, that was quite some race by Jake. I didn't really like consider how like quick it was compared to, cause I've never really like looked at the rankings or anything, looked at how fast people are. And then when I looked after and saw what time I had run and who it actually compared against, I was like, whoa, like, that's, that's not bad at all. Um, I think it, it's one of those goals, it's like, you see every year like with the shoe technology and people getting better like the times are keep dropping and dropping and dropping so you see like from 20 at uh, 2017 or uh, world champs or 2019 world champs the marathon was like 214 or something and they really got it really got quicker to 211 30 and that's what that was what my aim was just to get under it at like that point and yeah then it's just one of those ones. I want to try and take off the 10K Olympic time in six weeks, but just depends how my legs react, I guess. <laughs> I'd say they're reacting pretty well because Jake has just gone and run a 5K PB as well, which is amazing. When normally you'd have a, a few weeks off post-marathon. Yeah, I know. I've, a few people have said that to me, but I think it, it's just one of those that I said on my Instagram. I said, it might, these next six weeks might be the stupidest thing I ever do, but like everyone loves a gamble and it, if it pays off and it's quite a cool story, I think. I think I might need some time off after the trials though, but we'll see. Look, from all of us here at Run Through TV, Jake, massive good luck at trials for the 10K. Um, I, I mean, he's gonna do well, isn't he? We know he's gonna do well. So huge good luck to you, Jake. Thank you for joining us here on Run Through TV as well. Please do hit that subscribe button. If you don't subscribe yet, give this video a thumbs up as always. And I'll catch you again here on Run Through TV in the not too distant future.